check out this video that we got. Um, this is a brawl outside of a very fancy hotel Sunset in Los Marquee, Angeles. Man, it's yeah. famous. And that person there in the white sweater, that is Hayden Panettiere in the middle of a just crazy brawl. Uh, that went down last night that started in the bar at this hotel. Yes, uh, inside the bar, Hayden was there with her boyfriend, Brian, uh, and they, according to witnesses, got into, both of them got into an argument with another group of people. Uh, someone in that group claimed that Brian had spit on them, uh, and a manager came over and said, everybody out, get out. So this is kicked them all out. So they all got kicked out, and it seems here like they've got things calmed down. Not even close, it got so much worse uh, moments after this, as they're all now outside of the hotel, it turns into an all-out brawl, with, and Hayden is right in the middle of it. With Brian, they're fighting, uh, I think, against, like eight people. Yeah, it, it's really, Hayden and Brian against the world. Watch this. So the reason she's yelling, Brian, jail, she's reminding Brian that if you continue to pursue this fight, you might end up in jail. Brian is on probation uh, from a domestic violence incident involving Hayden, involving where Hayden. she was the victim. But he they're on back together. And he's on probation, by the way, until 2025. Right. So they're back together, and now she's trying to remind him, don't do this. You could end up in jail. Uh, it got worse. That Then the fight continued, and Brian ignored what Hayden said and continued going toward these people you see that's Brian in the white sweater who just got hit now someone's on top of him and Hayden isn't walking away from this she is right there trying to pull people off of Brian she gets knocked over uh, this is crazy and at, at one point in that bedroom. guys it, it looks like she even took a foot to the face too it looks like she got kicked I mean the way this thing started, it was inside the bar. We're told that Hayden and Brian had some words with that other group there. And it was alleged that Brian had spit on someone from the other group. The manager said, you know what, get out of here. And that's what we see happen. Uh, police were called, but by the time they arrived, uh, everyone had kind of dispersed and no report was taken. Uh, but you wonder if at least someone from the other party is kind of thinking things over this morning and, uh, and may do so. Because it looks like Brian's the aggressor. The other group had walked away, and he charges back. Back after yeah, that. And, and, I mean, that's the, the thing. Way, regardless of whatever happened in the bar, once they got outside and it was broken up, for whatever reason, Brian continued to pursue it. You and, guys, and that looked like, like Hayden hurt her it, face. It, it, it resets once you're outside the bar, and if he becomes the aggressor outside, even if he wasn't inside, um, he's in trouble for this. And you don't need to file a police report uh, if somebody wants to start a probation violation case. Uh, his probation officer, if he finds out about, or she finds out about this, um, they could go right to the judge and say, he's violated probation. So even if there's no police report, he's at risk here with the probation officer. Yeah, this is, um, and, and, and it does seem like the, in the aftermath, um, Hayden and Brian were walked back into the hotel by it, maybe it's security. She sustained some sort of injury there. I don't know if it's, uh, it looked like she had hit her face on the ground at one point and she's looking at her hand. Certainly, I'd imagine she got some road rash from uh, what was going on there, but. I am assuming since they were situation. at the bar, there might well have been, this might have been alcohol related to some extent. Yeah, I think it's fair to say that some or all of the people involved had had something to drink. Hey, it's Pez in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, I got to spend a few days on the set of Nashville with, with Hayden. She's really a truly a lovely woman. Um, but I've got concern that she's involved with this guy, Brian, and he is absolutely toxic for her. I mean, this is there's no excuse for this kind of behavior, and her getting dragged into it trying to protect him is just not good. You know, I, I know a lot, there's a lot of people that knew her from the show that are concerned. Yeah, yeah. it has been a very tumultuous uh, relationship with her and Brian. Interestingly, this time, the one time we've seen them, they were actually a united front. Um, but it still may, but end, up, still, it still may end up very still badly physical for violence. Him. That's right. Yeah. And that all is very concerning, not just to him, but to other people as well. Yeah.